We have a, a prayer that we would like for you to share, a public prayer for everybody, uh, for anybody. And we're going to put it on our um, Zoom, television, all over, any place we go, we have people who are praying. And we'd like to offer you, please, the ability to pray for all people. And uh, would you be willing to do that? Sure, sure. That, that would be just great. It'd just be great if you would, please. Sure. Thank you. Father, we just thank you for this technology that can connect us with America and Israel. Uh, what, a, what a wonderful technology that we can be uh, anywhere in the world and yet and still be connected, to be able to hear each other, see each other. First of all, Lord, I want to pray for Susan. Uh, I just thank you for her life, the way she has dedicated her life to you, the way she honors you and spreads your word and uh, shares the love of God in Jesus' name. And just thank you for her life. And Lord, we remember our good friends, Pastor Bob, uh, Billy and Marilyn, and, and many others, Lord, that we have uh, known throughout the years. We just thank you for this camaraderie that only comes through the power and the presence of the Holy Spirit, just knitting our hearts together. And Father, I pray for all of those right now that are watching and listening and just blessing over them. Uh, here from Jerusalem, uh, the city that the Bible says is the city of the great king. So we just bless them right now in Jesus' name. For anyone who really doesn't know Jesus as their Lord and Savior, I just pray that this could be an opportunity for them uh, to acknowledge the free gift of eternal life you've given to us, Father, in his name and through his blood. And uh, that happened right here in this city. And, uh, and Lord, for all those that are uh, suffering through this COVID pandemic, many people have lost loved ones and they're mourning. Some people have lost livelihoods uh, and they're, they're hurting. Many people have uh, lost uh, in different ways and so we pray for restoration we pray for that you would restore uh, lives and livelihoods that you would comfort those who mourn and the lord that you would protect those who um, who may be hurting themselves right now uh, physically we pray for you that healing that can only come through you and father we we just want to bless you and praise you and lord as we talked about difficult days that may be coming we pray for the grace of the Lord that would allow us to keep our eyes fixed on you, Jesus, the author and the finisher of our faith. And Lord, the, the one who, um, it, what is it's all about. And Lord, we help, uh, ask that we could be uh, do all the things that we do in the light of eternity, because this life is like a vapor. And help us to run our race uh, with our eyes fixed on you, and that we could run that we would uh, get that prize, uh, that crown of life. And uh, again, thank you for Susan, this opportunity, and uh, blessing on each and every one, in Jesus' name. In Jesus' name we pray, and we thank you, Lord, for receiving this prayer. And we lift up Chris and his wife, Elizabeth, and we lift up Israel, Lord God, and we pray for our nation. And we thank you, Holy Spirit, that you live with us in your almighty name. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.